I'm asking all members, regardless of job position and title, workplace, work function, and work duty, to please sign the petition to support all skilled labor and trade and our wonderful admin staff that supports us all in this campaign. My name is Justin Treberg. I'm an equipment technician three with the Washington State Department of Transportation. I work out of the Okanagan facility, which is based out of North Central Region. Hi, I'm Teresa Aldridge. I am a secretary senior for Department of Ecology in the Tri-Cities. Hi, my name is Ben Olson. I am a paralegal two at the Tacoma Office of the Attorney General. Hi, I'm Amy Conklin. I work for the Department of Children, Youth, and Families as a Forms and Records Analyst three. My office is the Everett Regional Office in Region three. So our campaign for support staff is support staff support us all. And we came up with this because in every agency, there are support staff that are the backbone of that particular agency. They are some of the most important positions in an agency, getting things done when other people don't necessarily have the know-how or are busy doing other things. And it's those support staff are some of the lowest paid in those agencies. And so it makes it very difficult for them to feel their value when they're not paid as much as they should be. Okay. So as committee chair of the SLAT committee, which stands for skilled labor and trade, we have introduced a petition statewide to support all trade staff across all agencies for fair and equitable pay. We are the staff that keep our buildings functioning, our equipment in repair, our internet and radio systems for communications across the whole state in good working order. So all, all staff at all agencies can perform their daily work duties. Staffing levels across the state, statewide, in the trades division, the levels are low. It's extremely hard to get qualified applicants to apply or to even get an application to fulfill one, one position. Every state employee has a right to be able to live on what they make. I personally know of people who sometimes have to make a choice between do I buy food for the table? Do I buy gas to get to work? And Am I going to have enough to pay my rent next month? I would encourage everybody to fill out the petition that was emailed to everyone so that management knows you support this and how important it is to pay living wages to our admin support staff. I think the people that I would like to talk about the most are our legal office assistants. So they are our receptionists. They are the ones processing the mail. And even in the kind of modern age, the courts still do a lot of stuff by paper, a lot of stuff by mail. It's required by law and court rules to do things by mail. And I know some of our legal office assistant staff, they have told me personally that they can't afford, they can't afford to live in Pierce County in the Tacoma area off of what they make, but we need them. Like uh, there, there, there's no getting around that our office is at a very basic level dependent on their work. And in my case, you know, working in the social health services division, you know, these are cases of children who have been removed from dangerous situations who really need help and sometimes the help that they need is hung up by a piece of paper that needs to be taken from our office to the court for a judge to sign so it can be official